All right, GearHeads, it's Jeff with Gear Report, and we're still at the airport. Uh, you can see the uh, aircraft in the background here. We're here to kind of highlight that uh, Oregon Aero, the, the company we're working with on this uh, set of reviews, does more than make aircraft seats. So Gail is here from Oregon Aero, um, which by the way, we're in North Carolina. Oregon Aero, guess where they are? It's Oregon. not North Carolina. <laughs> so we really appreciate you coming and uh, helping us uh, get started on this review of the Humvee seats by Oregon Aero. So we've already seen how to install the driver's side seat. And now Gail's going to show us exactly how easy it is to install the passenger side seat. So what you see there, Gail's holding the battery box uh, cover. So down here we have two really big batteries for the Humvee. This is a 24 volt system. Um, so big batteries, lots of current flowing through them. It gets kind of hot down there. We'll come back to that. Just remember that. This is the cover that sits on top of it. The four holes that are inside that black Velcro area are where the old seat cushion bolted. The seat had studs in the bottom that stuck through those holes with bolts on them. So I've already taken those out, taken the original seat cushion off, and installed the three Velcro, Velcro strips you see here. So I've got a pictorial that we'll post on gearreport.com that shows that. Now, uh, Gail's putting that in place. It just slides down in there. And now, um, because of the heat produced by the batteries and the electrical components and other things, the bottom of the passenger seat cushion has a thermal barrier. So you see that reflective surface. It's also got um, a layer of Kevlar uh, in there as well as an additional barrier. Is that Kevlar, um, is it just a heat barrier? Is there any kind of you know, ballistic protection provided by Just that? a heat barrier, heat as far barrier. as I know. Okay, it's good to know. So you see the three pieces of Velcro on the bottom. Those are sewn on and they match, odd as it may sound, the three that I put on the seat base. So installation is as simple as setting it in place so the Velcro matches up. Um, initially, you know, you have to clean off the seat base make sure it's clean so that the Velcro will stick to it, but it's got a sticky back and it goes on pretty easy. So initial installation isn't that difficult either. So now the seat back for the passenger side, the seat frame is in place already. So the, the cushion has a pocket on the back that slides down over the, um, the seat back frame. And then at the bottom, you see there's a strip of Velcro that I applied to the seat back frame. There's a mating piece on the back of the seat cushion and there. Um, if I weren't talking, this would have been about a 30 second process if we went really slow. You know, it slowed down because I was talking about it. But uh, um, does the seat, the seat base has the thermal protection? Is there anything in the seat back? No. No, okay. And that makes sense because it's not directly on top of the battery box. So there you go. We've seen how to install the driver's seat and the passenger seat in a Humvee, the, uh, the cushions from Oregon Aero. So really nice upgrade. Go check them out. They're OregonAero.com on the web. You can purchase directly there. These are some kind of custom covers that they made in the camouflage to go on these seats. They can make a pretty much whatever you want, right? Yes, yes. And I've seen embroidery on some of them as well, I believe. Yes. So you can have them customized however you like. Anything you would like. Yeah, if you like the standard olive drab, they can do that. That's what you'll see pictured on the website. And uh, budget, if you want to get these uh, around a little over 300 bucks for each piece. So the seat base or the seat back. And uh, what you'll get is a much more comfortable, supportive, ergonomic, seating solution that means that uh, although your Humvee is still loud and uncomfortable in every other way at least you have good seats to sit in so <laughs> they, they turn this uh, rather impractical beast into something uh, a little more comfortable to drive you may notice that I'm kind of babbling here because I'm sitting in the driver's seat and I really don't want to get up <laughs> so it's that comfortable we hear but, that a lot. Uh, so we'll have the full written reviews of the uh, drivers and passenger seat on gearreport.com and you can go check us out on 
Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, we're all over the place. And uh, go see our friends at Oregon Air while you're out there. They make a lot more than airplane seats. Um, you know, I should have brought my aviation headset. We could have talked about the upgrades you do for those. A um, whole variety of different um, aviation, ground transportation, maritime. You know, they got all kind of different products to make uh, vehicles more comfortable and safer to drive. So go check them out.